guys, Apa Kabar, I'm Yazik, I'm a singer and a vocal coach based in Warsaw, Poland and thank you for all of your suggestions. I understand your needs and I read your comments and you guys keep telling me that I react to female singers mostly and I agree and I love female singers and it's time for a new male singers on my channel. I don't think I've ever reacted to him. If I did, let me know. Faisal Tahir, singing Ratu. Are we ready? Three, two, one, go. Mungkin tiba sudah masa untuk ku bicara Mungkin tiba sudah waktu untuk kamu tahu Wow, I love his voice. Very manly. It's kind of slow. It's just tiny, a little bit breathy, but it has a lot of meat. Let's carry on. Lama sudah ku sembunyi Ku simpan sendiri Ku harap kau memahami Bila kau ketahui yeah, very conversational way of singing and I love his style. He looks very manly, nice glasses, hairstyle and all of that. It looks as if he was a rock singer in a way. Let's see if that song will go to that place, musically speaking. I don't know what's the lyrics, those lyrics about. Let's see if there, there are any subtitles. No, so I have to ask you to write your interpretation of the lyrics. What you think about it and what's it about. Okay, please, thank you. <laughs> That was weird. Please, thank you. <laughs> okay, let's carry on. Maafkan aku tak termampu Membohongi lagi diriku Tiada yang lebih aku mau Selainmu Jadi ratu hidupku Maaf aku tak mampu Menyakiti lagi diriku Tiada yang Four. Nice. What if I... Yeah, I love that. What if I... Beautiful. And to think that there is a lot of grit in his voice, rasp. It's a thick chest tone, let's say. Very manly, like I said. And for him to go like... It means that he explores, that he was looking for something in his voice while learning to sing, while developing as an artist. And I love that. I love that a lot. He's special. I never met you what if I... Sungguh tak aku sedari waktu yang of conviction and his storytelling skills are on a really high level and I really wish there were some English subtitles so I could get what he's saying during the song but anyway I can still feel a lot of a lot of things I love his artistry seriously and he's a really good singer as well he's jumping from his chest to his head and falsetto for a reason <laughs> So the low note was A2 da, 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 da. And he's mixing English and Malaysian, I think Smart choice And let me see if I can get these English lyrics ah, Again Love again Again <laughs> To her 
to fall in love again. I am too hurt to fall in love again. And again, I am too hurt to fall in love again. You see, this is what what's it about? I've got goosebumps everywhere because I understood what he was singing about, and whoa! You see, I was kind of expecting him to go. Oh, whatever, like, oh, we like really belting or whatever. And he went for his head voice. It surprised me so much and it gave me chills. To fall in love again, and again, and again, He touched me with this performance. I love it so much. A lot of range, a lot of passion, a lot of <sighs> vulnerability again. You see his high notes are squeezed and quite tight because he wants to achieve that grit, that rasp, that whatnot. It's understandable. It's good for singers like that to have this technique called lax vox to give your vocal cords massage. It's put in a straw. It's not a straw really. It's, it's a very thick straw in a water and blow bubbles in the water while singing. But it needs to be done and controlled with a professional. I do therapies like this and it massages your vocal cords and it gives them that energy to pull off really strong things to pull off. So if someone chooses to sing that way, very powerful, they need to know how to take care of their voices and he doesn't look like he's 15 and he's just starting. He's been doing this for years probably. He definitely knows if he can do it every day and if it hurts him or not. I'm not here to judge that. I'm here as a receiver of this performance and I loved it so much. I love singers like that. I used to want to be a rock singer and it changed because I started listening to more soulful music and it kind of grabbed my attention even more. I didn't know how to achieve that rocky sound and it really bugged me that I am not authentic. So I left my rock band to search for new things to do and I've always loved singers like that. Let me more know about him in a comment section, about his career, about his songs, about his past, Whatever you want to tell me, let me know. I love reading your comments. I've noticed that in Malaysia there are a lot of rock male singers, Aslan, him. The only one that I heard with a clear tone was probably Daniel Huer. So let me know if there are any more singers that sing with more clear tone, maybe more soulfully. Just out of curiosity, I wanted to check someone like that. So yeah, thanks once again. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you've not subscribed yet. And if you've wanted to work with me online, and you can just go to my website www.yaziksinger.com and you can book a voice session there with me and I'll see you in front of my computer or you will see me doing another reaction. Thank you so much. Till the next time. Bye-bye.